Hi, Jeff here, and I'm in Oman, in the Arabian Peninsula. But when you look at this backdrop, I could be in the tropics easily. Coconuts, bananas, papaya, mangoes, tropical fruit trees everywhere. There is no tropics around us. This small area is an area that has an unusual orographic effect. This is Salala. And in this region, there are mountains in the background there that pick up rains off the Indian Ocean and the African tropics. And just in this little area here, it rains in summer. It rains in July and August, a little bit in June, a little bit in September. It has a short monsoon. Now you can go for thousands of kilometers in any direction and you're in complete desert. We're not far to Saudi Arabia, Yemen, Iran, to the north you've got Egypt. There are no tropics around us. You've got to go a long way. You've got to go down the east coast of Africa to Tanzania or all the way across to Pakistan and India. This one little anomaly of climate extreme. Now it's very interesting that it's not just those mountains there, it's the geology of those mountains. They're very soft rock. They don't run off as much as they soak. And water is retained and soaks through and creates a high water table that's only eight to 10 meters down. There are 350 springs in this region as well. So you're growing tropics. You're growing classic tropical climate. Now, that soaking geology, that absorption of the rain has a lot to do with what's possible here. It's like a giant swale mountain range. We can do this by swaling landscapes and retaining moisture. There are levels of climate promotion. You can go from desert to humid in what the crops and trees you grow by the way you do water harvesting earthworks. This is a classic and I'm gonna show you around.